Well, this morning kicks off our Food for Neighbors food drive. The food collected today will go towards the victims of the recent apartment fire in Manitowoc. Our Emily Byer is live from the drive this morning. Good morning to you, Emily. Good morning, Haley. Hello, everyone. Yeah, we're here at the Festival Foods on West Mason Street in Green Bay. We're going to be here all day, rain or shine, collecting non-perishable food items to help those affected by that fire in Manitowoc. You'll remember one person was tragically killed, and about 85 others were displaced after the fire at Parkview Haven Apartments last week. As of Monday night, 15 people were still sleeping at a temporary shelter at Wilson Junior High School. The Red Cross says fire victims will be allowed back into their Manitowoc apartments this morning to gather some of their belongings and to get a first look at the damage to their homes. Now again, these folks desperately need all the help they can, can get. We'll be here all morning uh, and all throughout the day at Festival Foods at 2250 West Mason Street in Green Bay until about 10 o'clock tonight. Then the food will be delivered to Peter's Pantry in Manitowoc. They'll distribute the items to those affected by the fire. The Red Cross will also be here today to accept monetary donations. They'll use the money to buy anything else the victims need, such as clothing and blankets. So definitely stop on out, help us make a difference, and something as simple as a can of food is going to help those directly impacted by that fire. Haley, we'll send it back to you. All right, thank you, Emily. Still to come,